Welcome back everyone, my name is Echo, and today for you is a brand new Minecraft Seed Saturday Showcase. And today's video is a little bit different. I'm not doing Minecraft Console Edition, and I'm not focusing on Minecraft Pocket Edition. This is the Minecraft 1.2 Beta. And the reason why I'm doing a seed on this version today is because I really haven't done many seeds. And because this is releasing very soon, I want to make sure you have seeds for the iOS version, the Android version, the Windows 10 version, the Xbox version, which is this one, and of course, the Switch edition. Now, I am doing this in beta. However, these seeds should work when the game is fully released. I want to go through a couple of things because I first off want to start asking you guys, do you want more seeds for this version? If you do, comment down below saying potato. So today's seed is a Survivor Island seed that I found and it has the biggest mineshaft I have ever seen in Minecraft. Put it this way, it took me and Rob three or four hours to fully explore in survival, and it has over 50 or 60 plus um, spider spawners. Trust me, I'm gonna show you as much as I can. If you do enjoy it, please be sure to hit that like button. So let's get a play. Now, I wanna teach you guys about the seeds specifically. And that is because you can find your seeds in game without actually backing out. So, for example, this one, the seed for this one is right there. It's dash 986-18262. Now, of course, with this series, I do need your seeds. So, if you have any seeds for this version or any Minecraft version other than the PC, leave a comment down below with the seed. Make sure you have coordinates enabled, which is this. So uh, if, you, if you find something like a spawner, I know where to find it. So leave all the details down below. I am still doing Minecraft console edition stage just this week. I thought we'd do something a little different. So let's load this up. Again, I want to teach you one or two things about the seeds because in the current beta, your seed will display on the top. So while this game is loading at the top, you can say, see it says beta 1.2.029. Below that, it says Xbox One. It tells you your FPS. Now, as you can see highlighted now, it says S-986-18262 and then closed brackets. That is your seed. So the seed for this world is dash 986-18262. So I just wanted to run through that information before we get into this. This seed is not only one survival island, it has multiple. And the reason why this is good is because in this version of the game, you can do forward slash set max players and you can set max players up to 30 which means you can have 30 players in your game which means if you count these we've got one two three four five six seven eight nine around about 15 different islands you could do a 15 island survival island with friends like that would be so much fun so this is a really really cool seed again i found it just by generating random worlds. And don't forget, this is just the first map. I really didn't do too much exploring in this map. I haven't even explored the oceans because like I explained, I've been doing this in a survival world on the Xbox, no, I didn't, not on Xbox, on the Windows 10 version. So if you do find anything in the ocean in terms of Guardian Temples, please leave a comment down below with the coordinate locations. So again, this island, it doesn't, it has trees and they're oak trees, which means you're gonna get apples. It does have, a couple of, a couple of these. All right, so you're gonna grab yourself probably a couple of seeds, Not nothing great. Again, you do have nearby islands, and some of the nearby islands, this one being as an example, does have sugarcane. Now, if there's any lag spikes in today's video, I apologize because this version is definitely struggling with a, a couple of lag issues, this, this current beta build. Um, but if you need sugarcane, it's there. And to be honest, guys, that island is probably better than that island. However, this one is how I found the, the mine shaft. So the mine shaft is absolutely huge um i'll show you the coordinates but i started here and went down so i'm on the position there four nine nine four sixty three and nine um i was just digging normally and then i came across a mine shaft so if we go all the way down to it goes x y and z so the y is 19 so if you come down to 19 come to this position sorry come to this position you're going to find it now you can go literally in any direction but i'm going to try and show you as many spawners as I can. Um, oh yeah, by the way, you'll find a lot of gold down here, and it also has a lot of minecarts with chests. I noticed uh, a lot of diamonds, actually. So I'm just going to go straight this way, because I, I remember finding, I think it was like three, four, five spawners next to each other. Um, 
it's absolutely insane. I, I fully recommend testing this. If you if you like to adventure and you like to explore, this is definitely gonna be a seed for you. So here is here's the start of this. Okay, so we have two spawners right next to each other. One right there, one right there, and I believe there's another one somewhere as well. So I'm I, you know what? We'll break a couple of them. I'm not gonna do all of them, but there's one. There might be another no, there's not another one there. I know there's another one over here though, so that's that's two spawners. There's another one over here. Which is going to be, where is it? Three. You'll notice here there's three. There's another one, which is four. And guys, it's just constantly like this. I kept breaking them and thinking, you know what, is that going to be it? But it's not. There's just so many spawners in this world. Now I'm going to try and find myself a couple of chests as well. Because there is a, a lot of minecarts in here. This would be such a good map for hide and seek. So if you... If you're a fan of hide and seek, you could definitely turn this into a hide and seek map. And there's another one. There's five. It, it's got a ridiculous amount. Let's just quickly break this way. Uh, minecarts, minecarts, minecarts. It, it's already hide and seek. Even though I'm in creative, it's really hard to find everything. And I'm pretty confident. If I remember last time, there was a minecart around here. And I'm pretty sure it had an enchanted book. I can't quite remember where it is, though. And here's another spawner. Is this another one? Uh, nope, I think we've already broke this one. All right, well, we're around. Here. It's around here. There it is. Okay, so this chest comes with it does come with enchanted and it's infinity All right, you can't complain with infinity already It also comes with melon seeds So if you're a big fan of melon like me, then you're gonna find some melon seeds and here's even more spawners So this one is oh, we've already broke these ones. I think yes, I think we've already broke these ones So we'll go we'll go which way should we go? We'll go this way See if we can find ourselves any more. Now, when I was exploring this, I did come across a couple of broken, like, zombie spawners. What I mean by broken is they didn't have any spawner inside them. So I'm guessing this is kind of like a glitched mineshaft. However, we did find ourselves one or two spawners that did work. Other than cave spider ones, by the way. We found ourselves... I think it was like a zombie one, and I think it was a skeleton one that did work. So you're gonna find lots of goodies. And as you can see, I'm just I'm just breaking these like they're a common block in Minecraft. Remember, spawners are not meant to be this 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 common. And this is another chest. What's inside of here? We have ourselves a little bit of iron. Actually, an iron pickaxe isn't too bad as well. Got ourselves all the creepers. Got ourselves a bunch of gold. Now this is at Y level 17. So if you go a little bit further, you are gonna come across some some diamond levels as well. Now this is. This is a, uh, a a really really cool one actually. It's a lot of lapis as well. So I'm not gonna. Sp I'm just trying to find the goodies for you. I'm not gonna spend too much time just going through all of this. I'll let you do it in your in your own time. Um, but for the people who watched my stream, they did see me break like 50 or 60. There's even more than that in this. This one comes with a golden apple. Okay, so there you go. And I did I did find god apples in here as well. God apples can be found in here. But the, the spawners just they just don't stop. They they just literally don't stop. I think this is a thing for pocket edition. Like, for this version of Minecraft, spawners are meant to be common compared to the other versions. <laughs> because spider spawn spiders, uh, the cave spiders aren't as dangerous in this version compared to, like, the console version or the PC version. Uh, there you go, another golden apple. And this, <laughs> there's just so much stuff. There's just so much stuff to do inside of here. But I'll let you guys do the exploring. I just wanted to bring you guys a survival island seed that is fun with this version what's in here another golden apple it just doesn't stop when you think that you found it all and you've explored it all you, you literally haven't it just doesn't stop it just keeps on going and going and going so if you guys did enjoy today's video be sure to hit that like button if you have any seeds for this version remember to leave them down below i've been echo have a great day stay beautiful and i'll catch you next time bye